Don't zoom in, Andy. I'm rocking a thick unibrow. I think it's all the sun I've been getting. Soundcore, they reached out to us to sponsor their new Spirit X2 waterproof, truly wireless earbuds. Great for the gym, tons of bass. Let's check them out. Sponsored, okay? Spirit X2's rich bass-driven sound is fueled by the addition of an acoustic tube placed behind the driver. So they claim that they get 100% more bass on these ones. Uh, presumably that's co in comparison to the last Spirit X headphones. Those were like a pair of neck buds. They've got this, it's a little hallway behind the driver and you can imagine it like this. When you have a floor standing speaker in your home theater, for example, and you set it up beside your TV, probably right against the wall, it's gonna be bassier sounding than if you move that speaker away from the wall because the bass is coming out the back of the speaker and hitting the wall and bouncing back at you. So that's basically what they're doing here. Spoiler alert, I tried these on already and they're pretty bassy. Okay, this is a pretty big case, but it'll fit in my gym bag. So you can see that they're pretty similar other than the fact that there's, they're not neck buds. They're pretty similar to the previous iteration. Although on the first version of these, they had, uh, it was pretty much thin all the way through here. Now it looks like they integrated a lot of that circuitry and business and battery into this part of the earbud. They're surprisingly light for their size. And if I follow the little instructions here on how to put them on, a little bit of in, behind, and some rotation. Actually pretty comfortable and, and pretty light. These are pretty isolating. I feel like I'm wearing earplugs right now. My voice sounds all weird. Uh, some manuals. Nice selection of extra ear tips. A couple different styles here. These ones are like kind of contoured, almost like AirPod style. These ones got the little, uh, little grips on them. I like this, this is a lot of variety. Cause you know, not all ear holes are the same. And there is a charging cable. No wall wart, just a USB-C to USB-A cable. Yep, there's a USB-C charging port right there on the back of the case, that's nice. Uh, there's also a button that is for reset. You put your headphones back in the case, you leave the lid open and you hold that down and you can like factory reset them. 545 milliamp hour battery. So they are advertising nine hours of battery life off the headphones. Uh, that's nine hours of playback and a total of 36 hours with the case. So I guess you get three additional charges from the charging case. These are totally gym headphones, hey? Um, not only are they like really on, but they also have an IP68 uh, ingress protection rating. The IP68 rating will defend against dust and water with sweat guard technology to resist the corrosive nature of sweat. Lasts 100 times longer than ordinary true wireless earbuds thanks to a submarine structure and hydrophobic nano coating. Cool. I've heard of uh, such coatings being on like on shoes and stuff like that. Sometimes it wears off over time, but nonetheless, happy to have it here. And if it increases the longevity of the headphone, cool. Suffice it to say, uh, you can swim with these for at least a half an hour, at least a meter deep, but probably more like three meters or 10 feet deep. For the controls, they are tactile buttons, which I actually like in a gym setting, particularly in a swimming pool or wet setting. Ooh, I just, Oh, hold on, I just pressed play by accident. So you can turn up the volume with left and right, down and up. I can pause it by pressing the bottom button on either the left or right. So it's kind of weird. The buttons are symmetrical in some ways and asymmetrical in other ways. Like I said, uh, it's volume up and volume down. That depends on which headphone you hit. But pause, it doesn't matter which one you hit. You can also hold down the play button for the Google Assistant, again, on either headphone. And if you hold down the volume buttons for one second, then that goes next song and previous song. So again, asymmetrical. If you hold down the button, it changes EQ settings. It'll go from normal to extra bass. So that's another component as to why these have 100% more bass. It's not just because they have that uh, acoustic chamber behind the driver, it's also that they have these new special bass algorithms, which I guess is just an EQ and you can toggle it on and off by holding down that button. Pretty cool. It's actually noticeable, but not like in your face obnoxious. You kind of have to listen to it a bit. You can compare like AB. Yeah, it's more bassy now, but it's not like get out of my face kind of bass. It's, it's good. There's some other algorithms that work here. It has CBC E.0 noise reduction technology for the mics. Hello, and welcome to a demonstration of the microphone quality of the Soundcore Spirit X2. This is what you can expect to hear. 
Uh, there's actually a settings button here and you can see some options for the headphone. These ones don't have a ton of options in here, but they do have a toggle for Qualcomm's aptX audio. aptX audio is basically a codec that will take reduced bit rate audio streams, like the type that have to fit onto Bluetooth, and then reconstitute them uh, in a lossy manner that actually sounds quite good. You can headbang in the gym. You can do aggressive deadlifts. You can just smash your head on the wall because you're sick of living in a pandemic. These are pretty on there. They stay in your head and they have good bass. And I think having strong bass is really important for a workout. You just need that drive. You can turn them up to pretty damn loud volumes and they don't sound too harsh. You know what? And Soundcore thinks that they're so good for the gym that they are gonna give you 15% off using the link below if you enter in the phrase gym companion. Thank you to Soundcore for sponsoring this video. Check them out with the discount at the link below. And if you think these are too big, you don't wanna rock that. I don't know much about these ones, but this is the Spirit Dot 2, and they have a lot of the same features on the box here. Thumping bass, they're comfy, uh, but they have touch controls and they're way smaller. And look, at the, according to this guy, you can sweat in these too. So check it out, everybody. You can get it on Amazon.